सो हेलो एवरी वन माई नेम इज तेजस एंड वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल सेल्फ स्टडी विथ तेजस एंड इफ आर पैशनेट अबाउट मैथमेटिक्स एंड एमिंग टू एक्सेल इन दी आई एम ओ एग्जाम देन यू आर इन दी राइट प्लेस सो टूडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न आई एम ओ चैप्टर ट्वेल्व रेशो एंड प्रपोर्शन सो लेट स्टार्ट सो चैप्टर नंबर ट्वेल्व रेशो एंड प्रपोर्शन मैथमेटिकल रीजनिंग क्वेश्चन नंबर वन द मिडल टर्म्स इफ फोर डिफरेंट नंबर आर इन प्रपोर्शन आर कॉल्ड डैश सो इन मिडल टर्म्स इफ फोर नंबर आर इन प्रपोर्शन दे आर कॉल्ड मीन्स सो करेक्ट आंसर हियर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर बी नाउ सेकेंड क्वेश्चन डिवाइड नाइन नाइन हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेल्व इन थ्री पार्ट्स इन द रेशो ऑफ टू इज टू थ्री इज टू सेवन सो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल वी हैव टू एड दैम सो सेवन प्लस थ्री इज ट्वेल्व एंड ट्वेल्व प्लस टू इज सॉरी सेवन प्लस थ्री इज टेन एंड टेन प्लस टू इज ट्वेल्व एंड नाउ वी हैव टू डिवाइड नाइन हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेल्व बाई ट्वेल्व सो नाइन वन टू बाय ट्वेल्व सो फर्स्ट वी विल टू ट्वेल्व सेवन जा एटी फोर एंड दिस वन विल बिकम इलेवन इलेवन माइनस फोर विल बी सेवन दिस नाइन विल बिकम एट एट माइनस एट जीरो नाउ सेवेंटी टू सो वी नो दैट ट्वेल्व सिक्स जाए सेवेंटी टू सो दिस इज नाउ जीरो नाउ वी हैव टू जस्ट सिंपली मल्टीप्लाई सेवेंटी सिक्स बाय टू तो सेवेंटी सिक्स इंटू टू तो सिक्स टू जाए ट्वेल्व सेवन टू जाए फोर्टीन प्लस वन फिफ्टीन विच मीन्स वन हंड्रेड एंड फिफ्टी टू एंड नाउ आफ्टर दैट वी हैव टू डू विथ नो यस वी हैव टू डू विथ थ्री ऑल्सो तो सेवेंटी सिक्स मल्टीप्लाइड बाय थ्री सिक्स थ्री जा विल बी एटीन सेवन थ्री जा विल बी ट्वेंटी वन ट्वेंटी वन प्लस वन विल बी टू हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी एट सो वन फिफ्टी टू टू हंड्रेड एंड ट्वेंटी एट विच मीन्स अर करेक्ट आंसर यर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर बी नाउ थर्ड क्वेश्चन फाइंड एम इफ फोर नंबर्स एम ट्वेंटी फोर सेवेंटी टू नाइन्टी सिक्स आर इन प्रपोर्शन सो दिस इज एम बाय ट्वेंटी फोर इज इक्वल टू सेवेंटी टू बाय नाइन्टी सिक्स सो इन ऑर्डर टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एम इट इज ट्वेंटी फोर इंटू सेवेंटी टू डिवाइडेड बाय नाइन्टी सिक्स सो ट्वेंटी फोर वन जै ट्वेंटी फोर ट्वेंटी फोर फोर जै नाइन्टी सिक्स एंड नाउ सेवेंटी टू डिवाइड बाय फोर इज एटीन विच मीन्स द वैल्यू ऑफ एम विल बी एटीन सो करेक्ट आंसर यर विल बी ऑप्शन नंबर सी सो फोर्थ क्वेश्चन इफ पी इज टू क्यू इज इक्वल टू आर इज टू एस देन द करेक्ट स्टेटमेंट इज डैश सो फर्स्ट वी विल राइट दिस P by Q is equal to R by S. So now what we uh, what we will do is cross multiplication, which means Q into R is equal to P into S. Which means the correct answer here will be option number A. Now fifth question: An equality of two ratios is called dash. A extremes, B consequence, C antecedents, or D proportion. So we know that the equality of two ratios is always called D proportion. So the correct answer here will be option number D. Now sixth question: Share of A, B, and C respectively are dash if rupees four five thousand four hundred and sixty is divided in the ratio of one by two, one by three, and one by four. So first we will convert them. So the LCM of two, three, and four is twelve. So three two ja is six, which means six. And now after that four three ja is twelve. And three four just twelve, which means six is to four is to three. And now we have to add them. So four plus three is seven, and seven plus six, or else we can do six plus four ten, ten plus three thirteen. So now we have to divide five thousand four hundred and sixty by thirteen. So first, uh, we will do is thirteen four ja fifty two. And if we subtract it, we will get twenty six. And we know that thirteen two j is twenty six. Twenty six minus twenty six zero, which means four hundred and twenty. And now we have to multiply it by six, four, and three till uh, till we can get a correct option. So forty uh, two into six. So six two j is twelve. Six four j six four j twenty four plus one twenty five. Which means two five two zero, and it is in option B and as well as D. So forty two 
into 4 so 4 to ja 8 and 4 4 ja 16 and 1680 so it is on only in option number b so the correct answer here will be option number b now seventh question the ratio of 80 centimeter to 3.5 meter is equal to a 190 centimeter by 7 centimeter so 190 and 3.5 to 7 centimeter is not equal so this is incorrect and now in option number b 160 centimeter and 7 meter so 80 80 into 2 is 160 and 3.5 or else we can consider it as 35 so 35 into 2 is 70 and and if we cancel that zero we will get 7 meter which means the correct answer here is option number b so eighth question what is the ratio of the shaded area to the unshaded area so first we will count the total number of uh, cubes here so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 so 10 to just 20 which means there are total 20 figures here and now we have to calculate the shaded area so this is 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 and now after that here this is 1 and now uh, sorry 6 7 and this 8 9 10 11 12 and this 13 which means there are total 13 uh, shaded figure and uh, from, from 20 there are 7 unshaded figures which means our correct answer here will be option number D now ninth question which of the following is equivalent to 7 is to 8 so 142 is to 128 so no because 142 is not divisible by 7 now b 112 is to 124 so 112 is divisible by 7 but 124 is not divisible by 8 now c 136 is to 116 so here also 136 is not divisible by 7 and in option number d 119 is to 136 so here uh, from 7 it is 7 into 17 is equal to 119 and 8 into 17 is equal to 136 so the correct answer here will be option number d 10th question if x x is to y is equal to 4 is to 5 then in bracket 4x plus 5y is to 5x minus 2y is equal to dash so which means x by y is equal to 4 by 5 which means the value of x will be 4y by 5 and now we have to put this value so here 4x plus 5y so 4 into 4y by 5 and now here plus 5y so we will write it directly and now after that we will divide it and now the next is 5x minus 2y so 5 into 4y by 5 minus 2y so now after that we have to multiply it here so 4 4 j 16 by 5 y so here 16 by 5 y plus 5 y and now here down 4 5 j 20 which means instead of 5 into 4 by 5 y we can cut this 5 and now the remaining will be 4 only which means 4 y minus to y so now after that we have to add them so here is nothing which means it will be 1 and the uh, denominator here is 5 which means into 5 and into 5 so 5 5 is 25 by 5 so 16 plus 25 so here 16 by 5 y plus 25 by 5 y bracket close by 2y which means it will be 41 by 5 by 2y so now after that 5 2 is 10 which means 41 by 10 and the ratio will be 41 is to 10 so our correct answer here will be option number 
A. Now, 11th question. Ratio is a method of comparing two quantities by dash. A. Addition, B. Subtraction, C. Division, or D. Multiplication. So, ratio is a method of comparing two quantities by division. So, correct answer here will be option number C. Now, 12th question. The antecedent and consequent of a ratio dash change unless there is a change in the given statements. So, the an antecedent and the consequent of a ratio cannot be changed unless there is a change in the given statements. So, our correct answer here will be option number B. Now, 13th question. In the word comparison, the ratio of number of constants to the number of vowels is dash. So, first we will count the number of cons uh, sorry con consonants here so 1 2 and 3 4 5 6 so there are six consonants and now uh, we will count the total number of words so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 which means there will be four vowels so 6 is to 4 so the correct answer here will be option number c so 14th question which of the following are not in proportion so a 7 a 12 805 and 1 1380 so 7 by 12 and 805 by 1380 so now uh, we will try to divide uh, 805 by 7 so 805 by 7 so 7 1 day 7 1 and your 0 again with 1 so 7 subtracted 3 and 3 5 ja is uh, sorry for 7 5 ja is 35 which means 115 and now we have to do 1 1 5 into 12 to see whether we get 1 3 8 0 or not so 12 5 ja is 60 12 1 ja 12 and now 12 plus 6 will be here 18 and 12 1 20 plus 1 which means 1380 so yes this is in proportion now in option number b 16 28 4 and 7 so we can see here 4 4 just 16 and 4 7 just 28 which means this is in proportion and in option number c 150 100 135 and 90 so 150 100 and here it is 135 and 90 135 90 and now what we will do here is first uh, cut them so this will 3 and this is 2 we will divide 135 by 3 1 3 5 and here 3 so we know that 3 4 ja is 12 1 and now 5 which means 3 5 ja 15 so we are getting here 45 and now we have to so we are getting here 45 and now we will try to do it with 2 so 45 into 2 so 4 5 ja 10 and 4 to j plus 1 9 so yes we are getting here 90 also which means this is also in proportion and now option number d 51 85 57 and 98 so we can see that this is not possible which means our correct answer here will be option number d now 15 question the ratio of 1 by 3 of rupees 9.30 to rupees 0 0.6 of 1.55 is dash so first we will find one third of 9.30 so 1 by 3 into 9.30 which will be 3.10 and now here 0 0.6 of 1.55 which means 155 into 6 so 6 5 is 30 6 5 is 30 and here 3 33 6 1 is 6 6 plus 3 will be 9 which means 930 and here we can see that uh, after decimal dots there are three digits here which means this will be 0 0.930 and now we will write it here 3.10 by 0 0.930 so now it will be so here are three di digits after decimal dot so here will be three zeros so one two three and now divided by 0 0.930 and here are two digits after decimal dot which means <coughs> 930 and after that 
two zeros. So now we can cut here three zeros as we can see, and now we know that thirty one <coughs> into three is ninety three, and thirty one ten is three hundred and ten, which means our correct answer here will be option number B. So if you liked the video, please like, share, and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.